Devante, a 2-2 draw against Rochdale today. Just what are your thoughts on the match? I don't, don't know what happened. Really. I think the first half I thought we did well. We got the goal. I thought we was in control of the game. Then came out the second half and it was just like literally a mad eight minutes. We just went 2-1 down out of nowhere. And I just think we've done very well to get back into it. And in the end, I think if it went on for extra five minutes, we would have won it. Uh, with the problems that maybe happened in the second half with the two early goals and the red card for Wes Burns, how important was it to keep going and plugging away and get that final equaliser? I think it's very very important. I mean, I don't think Wes was sending off the top. I think he's got the ball completely. I think the ref's been uh, the best against all game. But I think really, like, we came back into it well and we got the goal to go 2 2. And after that, I think it's a good result if you look at it. We got the goal. Actually, some scoring against his old team. Uh, did you think you maybe can go and get another goal before half time to maybe put the game to bed? I think, yeah, we had a few chances to maybe get the other goal and go 2 0. And I think if we did that, I think the game would have been done. But. You know, as it was, we was unlucky and then we came back into it, but the main thing is we got a draw out of it. And you talk about those two goals in the second half for Rochdale. Yeah. What kind of impact did that have on you and the rest of the team out there? I think it's just looking around, it was all a bit like, it was just a bit of shots, it was like, what's well, just up in there? But I think we just got ourselves back together, obviously. After losing Wes, got in the shape and we managed to get a point out of it, which is the main thing. And the, the coach made some uh, changes. He brought on Ashland, who got the assist uh, for your goal. Uh, again, just talk us through that equaliser. Ash keeps on doing that when he comes on and he keeps on doing well and scoring goals and setting him up. So I think I know he goes that wide, he's going to get the ball in and I managed to get my foot to it. So I'm just happy to get another one. And we talked last week to Jordi about the partnership that you two have got, but with other players as well, like Ashland to Conor McElhaney as well, who's come back today. Is it important that you all gel together on the training ground in the week and put that in on a match day? Yeah, I think it's obviously like me, uh, Ash, Jordi, we had longer with each other. So like Conor coming back now, we have to get used to his game again and see how we can gel with him. But I think like me, Ash, Jordy, we all have a good understanding. Uh, and eight goals for you now this season. Uh, have you set yourself a target now for, or do you set yourself a target, sorry, for this season? Uh, so to be fair, my target was to get, get like 10 before January, but now I'm nearly there, so probably will be setting myself a new target soon. Is there any indication what that might be for the fans? Uh, no, I just, just want to get as many as I can. And we talk about the importance of late goals and you go into the game against Scunthorpe on Tuesday and Saturday away at Shrewsbury. How important could that goal be tonight in terms of momentum and going forward? I think it's very important. I mean, that's like two games about a loss and then we go to Scunthorpe away, hopefully get another good result and it just sets us up to keep on going for the rest of the season.